Hey, what's up guys, CKID here, and in today's video, guys, I'm super pumped because I'm gonna be showing you all how you guys can get the AirPods battery life as well as the display to show up on Android like it does for iOS, just like this. Let's go. C squad, yeah, we started something great. My goal's on the horizon. I'm just cleaning off my plate. Listen up, we got tech so passionate, keeps the fire going higher. Hundred K still a goal, which I'm inspired. Hey, links for my peoples, they buying sequels. I'm just here to keep it peaceful. So comment after these bars. Share, like, subscribe. We moving closer to these stars. Another video is here, so sit back. It's up to par. Let's go. All right, guys, welcome back. Now I said earlier that this will work for your AirPods. Uh, but it also will work for you like Beats X as well as your Apple Beats headphones, etc. Basically pretty much any Bluetooth enabled device that has the W1 chip built in. But what's cool about it is that it will also detect what device that you guys have and display it as the icon as well as the charging levels on the display. So for example, if you guys have, let's say something like the Beats X earphones, then that's what will be displayed as well as the same as it does with AirPods, just like it does on iOS. So let's go ahead and get into what you are going to need in order for you guys to be able to try this out on your Android device. First, you just go into the Google Play Store and search for an app called Air Battery. Once you have that downloaded, next you wanna go into the Bluetooth settings and connect your AirPods or other W1 enabled chip device, headphones or earphones or whatever you guys have to your phone. Once that is done, you wanna go into the Air Battery app and you want to turn on the automatically open and close GUI option. Then close out of the app and using the AirPods, you just go ahead and open these bad boys up and the battery case and the AirPods will show on your device as the icon showing the battery percentage displayed right here on the screen, just like it does on iOS for your AirPods or as well as the AirPods case. Now I will admit guys, it is a bit slower on Android to pop up than it does on iOS, which is pretty much expected since Apple is optimized for its own products. But if you are a person like me that was missing this feature while using my Android device, which I'm demonstrating this actually on a Note 9, then you would actually appreciate this app to allow us as consumers to get more features using the AirPods on Android devices. Pretty much really making this app fix the issues that I had using AirPods on my Android device. Well guys, that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. If you found this video helpful and informative, go ahead and share this video right now with a friend. Hit that like button below, along with that subscribe button. You guys pretty much know the drill by now. Also go ahead and comment and let me know if you have any questions down in the description below that I can help you guys out with. Also consider joining my Discord server I have where C-Squad pretty much resides and we chat throughout the day between videos, talking about other videos amongst other things. I'll have that link down in the description below as well. Thanks again for watching guys, be different and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.